Art is the continued creation of the world. That's what art does. Art does not reflect the world. Joyce says, on the spindle of my soul, I go to create the yet created consciousness of my race. My mother once said to me when I was a kid, said, show me who your friends are and I'll show you who you are. Right? So, uh, in other words, every room I have, in the other room, in, in the bedroom I'm in, I have a Cezanne, I have a Watteau, I have Titian, Lion, Titian books, um, uh, Matisse books, and I have the great poetry of the world ever. And the great music, when I listen to Mozart or or Bach, or Beethoven, uh, you know. In other words, in other words, what greater thing that can you that can you fill your life with than the greatest things that man has ever done, doing the things that they're about? Art is like an internal joke among artists, so. The, the, the vast umbrella of the word of art covers everything. But specifically, what does an artist do? An artist makes art and he demands the credentials of art and investigated of art and he's gone through the whole thing and he knows, he knows what art is. It's not anatomy, it's not proportions, it's not uh, brilliant execution, it's not photographic likeness, it's it's not uh, journalism, it's not individual pain. Uh, it is to open up what the elements of art that make those pieces of art perpetually fresh, timeless. There was a young lady who, on a TV program of an interior kind of design thing was a painting of mine. She said, could I see your work? There was a lot of fuss made over the work on the program. Mm -hmm. So I said, sure. So she came here and I had a bunch of the black and whites that I've worked on for years. Stacks of that, another stack in the other room and I have another 50. Uh, and she's talking about, it. I said, what does it mean to you? Nothing. So, she said, can I pay you to be my teacher? I said, you can enroll at the Art Students League and hear me talk. She enrolled at the Art Students League. Six months later, she came here. And she said, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my, she couldn't see it before that. It was invisible to her. I had a guy last week with his mother and he wanted to buy something. And I told him, I said, why? Okay. So, the thing is, I said, can you talk to me about this? He said, uh, I know it's Wales. And he turned his face away. And so I said, look, top whale screaming has been harpooned. Right? There's a mother whale giving breastfeeding the little one while it's, while it's being harpooned. The whale on its back is being hacked up in chunk and it's vomiting blood. The guys that are chopping up are like clots of blood. And the whale in the corner is like a passage from life into uh, the great beyond. And 
the aspects of the water, the shape of the blood rhymes with this and so on and so forth, and there are, there are angles and diagonals running through the thing, and there are shapes in between that, and it's going, oh, oh, I see, oh, that's the mother whale. What the fuck did you see before? He didn't, he, he looked at it, oh, it's whales. When I look at this, I'm home. Uh, home. If I hear Mozart, I'm home. If I hear Wagner, I'm. Oh, yeah! Holy You're pulling a sword out of a tree, riding a horse, rescuing a fair maiden. So, what is home? Huh? What is home? Home is. When there is no. When there is no you. Awareness is home. 